Hello, and welcome back to the Midnight Moose channel. Believe it or not, it's time for Isaac. Okay, we did challenges last time. I think agreed run before that, so it's time for a regular run. We have the Polaroid, so if we go to the chest with anybody, we go to Lamb with anybody. Uh, Lilith. How about Lilith? Maybe we could go to the Beast with Lilith. I get the Tainted character unlocked. Tainted Lilith is very fun. That's something rare in uh, a game that makes you hate it sometimes. I'm not naming any games. It could be this one. It could be any game that you've recently seen in the last three seconds. Let's see if we can unlock a fun character on this seed. Y, J, F, V, D, 4, D, G. Mysterious Liquid. Sounds good to me. Now all we need is uh, Conjoined or something to really let us shoot more shots. Maybe Quad Shot. Maybe Parasite. That'd be pretty cool. All right, here we go. Looking good. Lilith, Lilith, Lilith. Shouldn't be a huge issue at the start. Hopefully we get some more familiars and, you know, our power increases exponentially. That'd be great. As we learned in a recent daily, more familiars equals good. And that thing's finally dead, which is also good. What else are we looking out for? I don't really know. Where are you going? You're going around. I don't like that room. Okay, Baby Plum, definitely a challenging boss fight. Not a familiar boss fight, because Plum Flute isn't a familiar... What am I saying? We're going to kill Baby Plum as per usual. That's all I'm saying. Uh, the Mysterious Liquid doesn't affect her unless she slams down and it does affect her. I don't know if that counts. All we know is it didn't affect Loki. He was slamming down on the holy water. I'd love to get these Incubi not behind a rock. Okay, there was a slam down. Did it do extra damage? I don't know. I had to watch my character. Doesn't seem like it did extra damage. Anyway, we're going to take a good damage up and head on down. I know it's a speed up. It's being, uh, it's thinking happy thoughts, you know? Say it and it comes true. That's what people always say. And then I say their head should explode, but then it doesn't. So, there's that. Okay. A bomb. That's pretty good. Mysterious Liquid will help us out until we walk into a spider all by our own self. It's pretty cool. Alright, we got a rainbow poop, which is nice, but probably not too helpful for Lilith, her one red heart. Good. Jesus Christ, a book we can't use. It's just a penny. We walk into the item room and find a penny. Well, at least there's a rainbow to brighten everybody's spirit. It's pretty nice. Alright. I really don't know what I was thinking there. This run's falling apart at the seams. This run... Falling apart at the seams. Alright, we gotta take out these flies, please. I don't have a key, I can't get in the shop. Well, with two cents, three cents, what would I buy? Not much. Half price something or other. Okay, Gluttony, you could really give us a health boost. For sure, that would make me feel nice. Not that kind of health boost, you bastard. Gluttony, you know what to do here. Don't make any mistakes I wouldn't make, okay? Make the same mistakes I would make. Please. Okay. Still need soul hearts and stuff to protect us for the run. But a health up's not a bad grab. For sure. Now let's lose it. Alright, well at least all these people walk. Oh, there's an invisible one. Also walking, true. But, you know... Let's, let's see if he gets some damage. Not really. Not really. Okay, good job. Put out these fires. Okay, Claudie. Shouldn't be a huge issue. Takes a lot of floor damage and we're good to go. These guys shouldn't be the biggest issue. If we work on one at a time, that will make us the safest individuals in the land. So, of course, we'll work on three at a time. Or did I say in the land? Like I was in the Renaissance or something? Don't speak to me. That's my baby bender. It's great. It's like spoon bender for our incubus. I'll take it 100% of the time. Against these characters, I'm going to need it. Oh, I like that glow. That purple with the green around it. That's a rare shot glow. But I like it. You know what I mean? I like it a lot. Plus, we got creep. Okay, this could this could turn it around. Did, did gluttony and baby bender turn this run around from a I hate what's going on to a this is fun? I think they did. Let's see what this... And, and we're propelled even further into the sun for Mr. Dolly with two of these bands. You know what we're doing. We're skipping that crap deal. 
Let's see what's up here. Maybe a key or something. Okay, kind of not a key. But that's fine. We got Spoonbender. We don't got to think these days to get a key. I stand corrected. And I stand in a super secret room full of... I mean, we could go get Book of Sin and charge it like two more times. I'm not that desperate for two more pennies. So we'll head on down at 440. Okay, not too shabby. Could do the beast still. Uh, Mysterious Liquid, how does that work in a 2D setting? It's probably broken. I don't know. What do we need for this character? Everything. Right, of course. Sure. I feel lucky. Well, that's fine. We got our key back, so I guess it was lucky. You know, not a bad chest. Overall, Curse of Darkness is totally fine. Uh, oh, lagged a little bit there. Hopefully I didn't sound like a robot. I don't know. You bastard. Anyway, we're going to be looking for an angel deal anytime soon. That'll be great. We're going to be using two people in this room. That'll be great. And I see a tinted rock as well. It will take us uh, two bombs to get there, I think. Shame we don't have the ladder. It would only take us one bomb in that case. And there you go. Thanks for the key. I'll go for a tinted rock. Why not? What's stopping me? Plus, we need to blow more up to get to a uh, small rock. What if we... It's probably impossible. Actually, I guess it's not. You just don't blow up the rocks. What if we did every other unlock and achievement except for blowing up 100 uh, tinted rocks or whatever? And obviously picking up every item because then you wouldn't get small rock. Well, I guess you get a death certificate small rock, but you can't get death certificate without unlocking small rock. Yeah, never mind. Okay? Never mind. Every, anytime I talk about something, you guys always say something like that. And by you guys, I just mean me acting as the opposing, you know, debater. Everybody here is actually pretty supportive, so I, I appreciate that. You know, now, now that I brought it up, I appreciate it. Okay? Is that what you wanted to hear? Is that what you wanted to hear? Because that's what you just heard. Okay, let's see what we can do in this room. Now that it's one-third over. Now that it's three-thirds over. Alright. Okay, more flies. Really not a huge fan of flies. Unless it's big fan, then I'm a big fan. Let's make that reference. Okay, should be a simple room. Full of poison skeletons. Luckily not poison skeletons. Because that would be bad for me. Super secret could be under there. Maybe if we get another bomb, I'd be willing to test it. Or I'd be willing to blow that rock sky high. Let's see what we get from this. Peep. Champion peep, in fact. Kind of scary stuff. I'll be honest. But the good news is we can line up here, the incubi can line up elsewhere, and kind of take care of the, uh, you know, all the dishwater, or whatever that phrase is. Um, okay. And look at that. We got homing. We don't even have to look at the guy. We're protected from his volley. We're moving to protect ourselves from his eyes. And that's what they say. Don't put your eyes in the sun. Don't put yourself in the way of eyes. Peeps. Eyes. And he looks like the sun when he pees. So that's a little mnemonic device you can use. It's about 300 words. And it's a little mnemonic device you can use to think about it that way. If you think about it that way. Alright, here's an HP up. Not happy, but that's fine. Angel deal. 20% damage all the time. Double damage when you don't get hit. I plan on getting hit a plenty. I don't know about you. I plan on getting hit a plenty. I'll get a nickel. I'll get... I didn't even see there was another one. I'll get two nickels and a penny. I don't mind that one bit. 25 cents? You know we gotta find our shop. This has turned into a great run that started out great. I don't even remember this run sucking before that gluttony fight. Oh yeah, I do. Anyway, we got uh, this. We got this. We're gonna have a homing halo of tears that home. So that's pretty cool. I know Crown of Light's a great item, but I plan on getting it off. Did I mention that? Alright. Well, this shop sucks. Thanks for nothing. You know, this this is the run, obviously. So, we're not going to be spending our money at the donation machine. A.K.A. we're not going to be donating our money. Magic Mush, for sure. Next time. Uh, what was I saying? So we're not going to be donating our money. We're going to need our money for a good shop when that ever reveals itself. I don't know when that'll be, but I do know this is the super secret room and mini mush guaranteed. I didn't even blow up the mushrooms. The hell are you two doing in here? Jeez. Okay, uh, we got our bomb back and a luck up. I don't mind that one bit. I'll take some luck. Going to need it. And suddenly we're doing just fine. Oh, we got to do another mother run soon. That'd probably be fun and interesting for everybody. Flood of Caves 2. 
that's not fun and interesting for anybody. Okay, we're gonna run like this. Somehow we don't get hit by the Mr. Mine lunging his face into ours. Big surprise there. Okay, shouldn't be a huge issue. Hopefully we don't creep an enemy down. We weren't expecting. Luckily we killed that guy. And I never uh, touched on it because it has no consequences to run, good or bad, because you can just ignore it. But Obsessed Fan is on the team. Obsessed Fan, welcome to the team. You are not noteworthy. Sorry. I think that would be me in real life. They'd be like, welcome to the team. Uh, you're not noteworthy. And I think they do that at my work pretty often. Obviously, uh, not my YouTube work. My YouTube work, I get praised with uh, praises beyond belief. But, you know, my, my 40 hour a week work week job, they're like, you know what? You exist. And I'm like, you know what? Eh, it's about right. And that's the effort I put into that. So anyway, let's kill this guy with creep because he's trying to kill us with creep. A bomb there looks good. Killing these enemies looks good. Oh, this is going to be a dodge. Okay, I'm glad we got on the other side of that guy before he went in a crazy starburst mode. I don't mind opening this door. This isn't the greatest item. But it already got us three pennies, so maybe it is. And half a red heart, if we deem it necessary, we can grab that too. Well, I guess we gotta... Anyway, I don't think this guy's gonna survive, but if he does, we could... He survived, how about that? I'll take a penny, and I'll take a look around. May have missed the shop, we might have to go back. Uh, I'll hold on to him for now, this is probably the way to the boss. So I will allow these monsters to live for only so long as I perish them and all of their next of kin. Another key is pretty good there. Okay. A Mr. Mind Death early on is... Never mind, we got hit. Uh, I was going to say something about it being good, but it didn't work out, because it was bad. So a Chub fight early on is also pretty bad, but luckily it's not early on. We're in Caves 2, for God's sake. We got plenty of manpower, plenty of girl power, plenty of incubus power. Demon power? What do you want me to call it? I don't know. Here's a bunch of HP. Thanks, I guess. Let's go find that shop. We got that 36 cents. We worked hard for it. I forget how we earned it. We probably didn't work hard for it. Take a right. Oh, well. Two soul hearts and three pennies? Don't mind if I do. Who's the item snatcher now? Another space bar we don't want. That's pretty cool. Uh, give me this, I guess. And, you know, I'm about to be donating. You're going to give me shops like that? I'm about to be donating. Game. What the hell's going on? Holy crap. Alright, we could pay that guy out. I don't like him. Looks silly. Holding that sign. What if I didn't walk by? He'd be holding that sign for nobody. It'd be ridiculous. And technically we could make it to boss rush. That's something we gotta unlock for this character. I don't know if you should do boss rush and the beast in the same run. But why not try to make it to beast? That's what I've been saying for three runs now. And Jacob and Esau couldn't do it. Eve could do it. Maybe because she was in the wrong mode. Maybe because it's Eve. Maybe a bit of both. And uh, maybe Lilith can do it, right? Okay. I'll take another lucky penny. We got three of those so far? Two or three of those? Let's see our luck's at two. I don't know what Lilith's starting luck is. Why would I know that? I'm not a game encyclopedia. Am I? Anyway. Thanks for the free penny. Thanks for the... Okay. No map this floor. Kind of stinks. I'll get over it, though. Alright, I'm over it. And, uh, let's do a bit of this. These guys can't stand and creep. They don't have legs. Item attractor. Apparently this doesn't count. Oh, just kidding, it does. Thanks for the free key. They wanted me to charge a key to get into that key? No, it's a free key if you got item attractor. Okay, this room should be pretty simple. Unless it's not. And killing any of these flies any day now would be great. Not when they're all near me, obviously. There we go. Okay. And there we go. Simple stuff. Let's check out what's in this room. If it's gray chests, we can steal them for free. It's not. And it amounts to just a bomb, which is fine. Might as well use this and speed up the uh, troubleshooting here. I don't have any trouble shooting these monsters to death. Here you go. I'll be here all week. Well, I, I post one video every day, usually. Well, with Isaac, there's been some daily videos where there's more than one. Hey, forget about it. It's not even that funny. All right. Two mom's hands, if I'm not mistaken. Luckily, we're not on the scene. Double challenge. There won't be four mom's hands. 
easy stuff. We got a emergency contact. That'll be useful. An emergency contact, I should say. Uh, Penny there is looking good. All right, I'll take two free keys. It allows us to go in the red chest if we want to. Maybe I don't want to. I do want these five pennies, though. Thank you, item attractor, for attracting the items. All right. All right, this is a room, for sure. Incubus is trying his best. Okay. I knew I was going to get hit, but it's not Incubus's fault. It's my fault. If we got bombs and keys, I'll do... What the hell? Where those hearts come from? Okay, well, we certainly made our stuff back, along with many monies. And, uh, that's great. I think we're... Okay, now it's bothered. I know I know. the map didn't bother me, now it's bothered me. I don't know where the hell we are. I don't know where we've been. I don't know much. Okay, we're gonna... Oh, it's a dead end. Okay. Let's take care of these two. Could be a super secret. Let's see if we get some soul hearts here. It is, it is unlikely. So, we'll save our bombs for something more likely. Uh, where are we? This is where we... Oh, I thought we'd been here. I thought we'd been all around here. Apparently I'm wrong. Apparently I'm not correct. It happens. It's rare. But it happens. Okay, a host makes this not a tough room. A bomb is fine. A black heart would be A-OK. -okay. okay. a -OK, in fact. Don't mind it. Obviously, I asked for it. Why would I mind it? Sure. This looks good. I keep thinking she has a red body, but it's the heart. Uh, no. Also, no, but, you know, we gotta do it, so you gotta do it. You gotta do it, you gotta get it done. So that's us, right now. Alright. And you're walking on the creeps, that's great. And we don't even have to aim. Lilith's an A-OK -okay character when you don't even have to aim. A lot of characters are okay when you don't have to aim. Not all of them, but a lot of them. Alright, let's we'll see what we get over here in this gray chest. I'm sure it's worth it. Two pennies. Two pennies for two bombs that we got for free in that room. Not exactly worth it. I'll take a damage up. I do not regret not picking up uh, whatever it's called. That's the end of that sentence. Where the hell are we? Maybe Greed opened up a way to go. Ah, oh, crap. Alright, I definitely don't know where we are. I know this is a dead end, though. So yeah, I did, I did know that. There's no curse of the maze, just curse of the no map. Okay, we've been here. This goes down to a small room. Okay, the cloddy room. Can we go down from here? Here. Here. Oh. Okay. I really don't know where we are. But I do know we haven't found the shop. Nor the boss room. So maybe that should be a priority. Yeah, I'm thinking it should be. But I thought this was a dead end. Let's check it out. Oh, never mind. I'm just crazy. Who knew? My therapist. Ha ha ha. Funny. Anyway, here we go. Push you onto the spikes. Charm of the Vampire, thanks for the free heal. Key, thanks for the free key. Shop and boss room next to each other? I could have told you that from the beginning. Actually, I guess I didn't know in the beginning. I only... Surmised that recently when we didn't have either. Habit can be helpful for this character or many other characters. I'm about to donate because I got 61 cents. But let's fight this. We're no longer basically nowhere near uh, on track for boss rush, so that's a shame. The navigation of this floor helped, quote unquote, with that a little bit, aka didn't help. Also, Reap Creep is going to help with that as well. We don't have a ton of damage, but for whatever reason, and correct me if I'm wrong, but Reap Creep never gets, like, two-shot. Or maybe I just haven't met him when I've been powerful. But I don't know. I mean, maybe you could two-shot him. But he just seems to die so much slower than any other boss. I don't know if he has the health or if he's just a jerk. I don't know. I've been conditioned not to worry about it by the free press. So I think we got a big problem with them. We're going to have to do something about it. You bastard. And I don't know what his tell is for Brimstone in front or to the side. So maybe you stand a little bit to the side, and then you make your decision. You stand right here, and then you make your decision. I don't need to help, though. Uh, tears or the wafer? I mean, the wafer is really good. I'll take a health up. And uh, what was... Oh, yeah, I wanted to donate, honestly. We got 61 cents. This thing's going to 
crash way before we uh, give in 40 cents. You know, we're not going to be spending that much. All that jazz. I'm sure we're going to go down to like 21 cents and have plenty for our shops in the... We donated 52 cents. I can't be upset about that. Got to look for the fool card. We got to look for the fool card on this floor if we're going to the beast. We got Wafer. We got Habit Lilith. So that's pretty cool. We got a D4 for the floor. So if we walk into the item room and we see Obsessed Fan or some other shit item. I was going to censor myself and I was like, you know what? There's no other word for it. Or some other crap item. Then we hit the D4. And I know Obsessed Fan's already on our team. I apologize, Obsessed Fan. Sorry about insulting you to your face or whatever. But, uh, something like Obsessed Fan, obviously, was what I was trying to get at there. Okay, maybe we didn't need double box for this room, but I was like, you know, it's a big room. We'll charge 66% of the way when we're there. That'll be fine. Let's do a bit of this. Any more of those? No, they're all dead. Fantastic. Thanks for the heal. Parasite. Parasite, chemical spill, mysterious liquid is what it's actually named. Incredible synergy that happens often. If I find Serious Liquid, I'm finding uh, Parasite later on. Couldn't think of its name for a while. Sorry about that. I'm finding Parasite later on, guaranteed. And that's why I mentioned it earlier. 19 minutes and 22 seconds ago. No boss rush, by the way. That's fine. Lilith can get a boss rush run at some point. This is her beast run and Lilith run, which reminds me. we got to do the thing with the trinket. Hey, haven't done that in a year. Let's do that. we got to find a trinket... Another one, because we already left Petrified Poop behind in the wrong room. we got to leave a trinket behind in the boss room. Or an item room. This used diaper is perfect. I know the perfect use for this used diaper. We're going to leave it behind in an item room. From the depths to item room, we got to find uh, that on the way up. If we want to unlock Tainted Lilith. Actually, this is the first time going, so we got to unlock the red key. So the red key is going to be in Mom's chest, so we don't have to leave a trinket behind. So everything I've done in the past minute has been worthless. What a surprise. Alright. We're going to kill these hands, no problem. A couple more left. We'll just take them out real quick. Alright, thank you for perishing. Just one more? Whatever. Okay, this map is turning into Swiss cheese. I hate it. I hate Swiss cheese. I don't feel that great about the Swiss, either. That's a joke. I've never met anybody from Switzerland, so... I have no opinion on that. This room, I remember it well. It ended my uh, Eaton Street many months ago. I hate it. It is now time for some revenge. And this is actually a pretty easy room. What was so bad about that Eaton run? Mm, I forget. Anyway, we got to find the item room and the Cursed Skull and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull. So let's do that. Penny's totally fine. I haven't actually been looking for the skulls. There's a 80% chance... We already walked by it, and I was like, yeah, that's fun. So, let's try and find it sometime soon. But we also got to find the item room, the shop. No, we already found those things. Then what the hell am I talking about? Just the skull, I guess. Just the skull's fine. One skull, please. Could be up here. And it is. Fantastic. Super secret room could be over there, though. So let's keep going. Maybe a bit more. Just a little bit. Full card looks good. Okay. It's a strange place to put a super secret room. Attached to the rest of the floor. What's going on with this floor? It's very large and partially useless. Unless there's a library or something down there. We can think about that later. Let's kill mom in Minecraft. And then uh, and we'll see what we do next. Okay. Two minutes late for uh, boss rush. 30 minutes late for landing on the moon first. Wait, 30 years? Actually, it's been about... 50... 3... Never mind. Uh, hmm. Well, we're giving it to the door, so it doesn't really matter. I didn't want to disrespect our first Polaroid by giving it to the door. You know what I mean? Uh, but we've had the negative, you know, once or twice. We've killed the lamb once or twice. I don't remember. I don't know. That's the truth. Anyway, we got hit, so we got that charge. We can use that to generate uh, charges. That's great. I have it, that is. So that means we can use the box on Dogma, get hit twice, 
clear the room and then have the box for the horseman. So I know I usually kill Dogma without getting hit, but I haven't seen the damn thing in a while, so I'm sure I'll be uh, unaware of its patterns. What was in the item room? Oh, Parasite. I literally forgot we had the D4, so there's that. Uh, no other items. The shop is super creative, if I'm not mistaken. We got a shop here, right? Where are we going? Mausoleum 2 or whatever? Whatever that is. Hey, an item room. Okay, well, we can't regret the question mark because that's a crappy space for item. So let's pick up a great passive item. Fruitcake. Gotta love it. Fruitcake. Thanks for spawning cards and stuff. That's what everybody likes about fruitcake. That's what we need from fruitcake. I'll stop saying fruitcake. Once it stops being good, fruitcake, fruitcake, fruitcake. Gotta love it. Alright. Well, you're all dead. So that was easy. Alright. Simple stuff here. I guess we do know what the mausoleum is because we did kill Mother. Uh, so I'll stop acting like I don't. Sorry for the uh, charade. Sorry for all the lies throughout the years. I really uh, I regret them deeply. Whichever ones you know about, I regret it deeply. I'll take this. A charge baby that gives us batteries that gives us more. Charge baby that gives us batteries? I don't mind that one bit. Any tin rocks or anything? Have we found anything useful in these uh, rooms? Not really. Hey, what the hell, man? I was trying to live. I guess so was he. You know what? Sorry. Uh, we'll fight some good old son of a gun. Alright, it's a good thing we got Wafer. I don't know what's happening anymore. We are being attacked. Almost walked into another shot. It's pretty cool. Can we get this for free? Is there a button? That's what I'm talking about. Alright. A bomb. That we spent a bomb for. You know what? It's still, it's still, Jesus Christ. It's still good because I feel good about getting it. That's the, that's the positive takeaway from that. Alright, the enemies are turning into poop. So that's cool. Thanks for the bomb. And we're losing a lot of health. It's a good thing we took Wafer. You're golden. You're red. Now I'm just naming colors like a toddler. Great job, Moose. You learned two colors today. Alright. Turn these. Okay, thanks for that. A pill. I don't trust that as far as I can throw it. And it's a tiny pill. You know I can throw it pretty far. At least an inch or three. Uh, super secret room. Where could it be? It could be here. Are there super secret rooms in this floor? Yeah. Not there, though. Uh, we were in the shop. I guess we weren't impressed with it. Our machine already jammed. Let's hear some people yell at each other. Alright. And not just me yelling at myself. It's gone. Alright. We're getting the red key, so we don't have to retrieve the trinket. Which is now a red key fragment. Also, that was quick. Sure. Thanks. Okay, so far so good. Just regular enemies in these weird, strange floors. Hey, a rune shard that I took damage for. Thanks. Didn't even do anything. I guess it was per throw or something. I don't know how the shards work. And soon enough, I won't have to know because we'll just have all the runes. That'll be great. Item room. We'll check it in case there's any special stuff, but it might be nothing. Or the red key shard, which is... Nothing. Actually, does that even work? Pre-red key? No. Perfect. Good. Great. Jess, like his father. Alright. Let's get some cash here. This is good. There's beggars all over these uh, floors. Often. So let's find a beggar. We're gonna get some maybe HP up. Look, we got a black heart. That's two hits. Hanged man. That's something. Let's find a beggar. Not these guys. Okay. That's a shame. Let's find a beggar and get an HP up. Not on this floor, obviously. What the hell was that? Something was exploding. Fruitcake, what are you trying to turn me into? Oh my god. Alright, good thing we got the wafer, because we turned that guy into cran. Lover's card honestly might give us more health than an emergency contact at this point. I hate these enemies, so I'm glad to find them when we're powerful-ish. Could have used a good old box, but we didn't need it. How do we take damage at the last second? How do we take damage? We're literally leaving the room. If it was those enemies dying shots, I hate them even more now. 
so take that to heart. Get you out of here. Hanged man card, stop showing up. That'd be great. It's down here. Could be a good card, could be two of hearts, which is worth more than a lover's card, especially in the final fight of uh, whatever it's called, because you don't gotta go rubbing around for the red hearts in 2D uh, wave. I'll pick this up in about a minute. Thanks. And this is a dead end. So I'm leaving. Take me out of this floor. Thank you. Okay. Two of hearts is going to be great. It provides three red hearts for us, presuming we use it at the right time, which I presume I will. What's up with all the shards? Thanks for half a soul heart. Appreciate it. Thanks for taking my half a soul heart. You're a jerk. But that's why we got it in the first place, so we could lose it. Fruitcake, can you stop teleporting the enemies? I mean, it's kind of rude. Just wanted to say that. Alright, we're bringing this black heart to the beast. There's no way we're losing it on the trash, or on dogma, or anything weird like that. Let's see what's in here. Cool. Magic mush would go well. Mini mush is perfectly fine. I'll settle for neither, apparently. Gotta love these Trisigion, uh Immaculate Halo tiers. They're very odd. They're very hip. I like it. Oh, okay. I just thought that was going to be the end of the floor. It's not. That's fine. I wanted this card anyway. Magician. Magician would be good, but we already have Spoonbender. So, what's Magician do at that point? Three range? Not that helpful. Let's knock some ice into this guy. And honestly, just leave. I'm not going over there can't make me. Let's leave. Again, as I previously explained. Basement 2. Fantastic. We're going to be done with these guys. Maybe the uh, mulligans. That was dumb. We'll keep the box, believe it or not. We've systematically only lost health since going on the home path, so I can only say we have a good chance of winning this run. Pinky Eye is totally good, but not better than homey. Uh, that's not... Good. Here we go. We didn't find any beggars. All we found was some cards that all have their own kind of uses. Oh, Jesus Christ. I'll take a half heart, thanks. If we're going to make it to Beast with this half heart, we're not going to lose it to some weird trash waves or dogma. So that's... Okay, that was the lie. A bomb is fine. This room should be... Oh my god, everything's exploding. This room should be pretty simple. Assuming no more pots explode, confuse me. Two bombs. That's it. Okay. We got half health, but we got the wafer and way to make more health. So we have a chance here. Plus we have four more pennies. Incredible. And this penny. That's awesome. Alright, this room looks nice. This room looks inconspicuous. There's the red key. Incredible. Alright, here's something actually incredible. A fun character in this game, believe it or not. Lilith. Box of friends. Oh, we gotta sleep in the big bed. No problem. No issue there. Maybe Battery Baby can do us a favor and drop us a battery in this fight. Seeing that other Incubus with no wings is really weird. Uh, I, I like this boss announced screen. This one here, the white background is really cool. That's all I gotta say about that. Anyway, it's time to kill the TV. I think the first three times I fought this guy, I tried to shoot at the ghost. And obviously you can see a shield. But I still saw some damage being done, so I was like, I don't know, I guess it doesn't work. But, you know, you got to shoot the TV. And if you don't know that, I'm not going to blame you. Because I didn't know that for years. Well, maybe a week. Anyway, we got a red heart on the floor, so if we get hit again, that'd be great to pick up. Dogma, if you could hit me once. Actually, hit me once. Thank you. Now our thing is charged, and now we're at full health thanks to the heart. Any other red hearts we might drop to old, due to old damage, um, we can pick up in the future also for sure. Gotta hate this attack, everybody does. How did we not get hit there? I don't damn know, but I'll take it. And then we're gonna have uh, Incubus Galore for the final fight, so that's pretty cool. Alright, we're doing a little bit of dodging here. No aiming, of course. We got homing for that, but even so, during this attack, who aims anyway, not me. And that's, that's what's his name. Okay. I, that battery wouldn't have really helped. I don't know how long I was sitting there, I just saw it though. Okay, that's the last fight, right? No, just kidding. Here's another fight. Oh, and we have uh, Succubus from getting hit so much, even though we only got hit like once. 
this whole run. I'll take this cash, I guess, in case we spawn money equals power, baby, from uh, Campaign Conception or something like that. I don't know. Interesting stuff. Very interesting. Okay. If we see any batteries in the air, we definitely got to catch those. Thanks to uh, Battery Baby. But I don't see any in the air, so we don't got to catch those. Also, we're only going to be making more and more uh, friends. So there's more and less need for more friends. Why is everybody turning into money? Red Heart? Don't need it. I'll be honest. Where's the boss? Is he in He's in the lava. Okay. Didn't expect that. You know, always hide where they least expect. That's what I've always told my hide-and-seek uh, two Ts, which is a word for people to get tutored. It's a semi-common crossword word. That's the only reason it exists. Anyway. Otherwise, it wouldn't be a word. All right. We're doing pretty good here. I wouldn't call us overpowered. I wouldn't call us underpowered. I'd call us pretty powered here. The game is lagging. I'm sure if this was a console right now, it would just crash. Maybe it's because we have 16 halos, 16 tiers, and then each. 16 times 16 is famously, uh, I don't know, 236-ish. That's a guess. Probably less than that, actually. Anyway, it doesn't matter. We're not here for math. We're here for vengeance. Vengeance against death. That was. That's now complete. We got a black heart from what? I don't know. Probably fruitcake. And now we kill the beast, whoever that is. And then, uh, and then I think that's it. It's the last unlock we need to do with the whole game. Let's kill the beast. Rotten Penny has appeared. Why? Okay. Spawn 600 pennies in the beast's mouth. Is that the achievement conditions for Rotten Penny? It must be. And there you go. We're doing pretty good here. Holy Shot is following the beast like it's his birthday. And uh, I guess we could do another Cubist. There we go. And look at all these obsessed fans. I mean, how can we lose with six obsessed fans? It's really impossible, in my opinion. Alright, so far so good. Not a bad run. A fun run and a fun game all the time. Here we go. How about that? He's on fire. He's got Explosivo growing on him. Her, excuse me. And all that good stuff. And that's that. What do we get? The depths are dank. That's terrible. C-section, that's great. And maybe that'll make future runs great. I don't know. I'd hope so. And that'll do it. Thanks for watching Isaac. Uh, leave a like if you liked it. Leave a dislike if you hated it. Subscribe if you want to see more. Thanks for hanging around. Thanks for watching. Thanks for being here. We're starting on the journey. We got the home. And who, who are all these freaks, right? Well, they're doors. Can doors be freaks? I don't know. Then we got her. So there you go. And that's that. So see you next time. Thanks for watching. Take care of yourself. And, you know, more to come. So stay tuned. Here you go. See ya.